Technical University of Kenya is located in Nairobi Central Business District. Nairobi is the heartbeat of the East African economy and a major gateway into the rest of Africa. TUK, as it's fondly known, is home to students from various countries in the region. Kenya Polytechnic itself was founded uh, in, in 1950s, built in the present site in 1960, and given the name the Kenya Polytechnic. From that time, it was a premier institution for training technologists and technicians for Kenya and in the early years for the whole of East Africa. With such a rich foundation and history, the university has managed to attract a vibrant community of over 15,000 students. As we develop our capacity in, 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 in technological development in the short term, we should be looking at uh, this country's uh, Vision 2030, which is committed to making Kenya a technological country, that is, it should be possible for us to produce quite a good number of the, of the things or products we need in this country. In 2007, the Kenya Polytechnic was elevated to the status of a university college, which now gave it uh, the powers to teach at degree level, but to grant degrees of another university. As, um, as a university college, it was established as a constituent college of the University of Nairobi, which meant that it could only award degrees of the University of Nairobi, although it had powers to design its own curricula, get them approved by the University of Nairobi Senate, and then to uh, award degrees in the name of the University of Nairobi. TUK offers an array of programs and courses in three faculties. The Faculty of Engineering and Technology, Faculty of Social Sciences and Technology, and the Faculty of Applied Sciences and Technology. The university boasts some of the best lecturers in Kenya who offer hands-on training to our students. We have state-of-the-art facilities and cutting-edge laboratories. The way we are training our students, they are getting state-of-the-art software. The future of engineering is dependent on using the tools and techniques that engineers and manufacturers and industries using out there. So the kind of training provided at the Technical University is one which is state-of-the-art. Our students are innovators. They graduate with skills and confidence to thrive in today's competitive job market. So our school doesn't really limit us to just classwork. They help us get there, they help us broaden our wings, so to say. They help us get to places I don't think I would have gotten to if I wasn't here. UK offers a special kind of a course, BTEC. I studied BTEC in journalism and mass communication. That BTEC means you get, yes, the theory part, and in addition to that you get the practical part. So that at the end of the four years, the five years, or the six years, you have the practical and the theoretical. You can easily even start up your own company for whatever you studied in. TUK students not only excel in academics, we also encourage them to nurture their talents in other disciplines.
We boast an impressive alumni who work in leading corporations in Kenya and across the world. Some of these include Kenya Airways and major airports such as JKIA. When you walk alone, you walk fast, but when you walk with others, you go further. TUK has partnered with other institutions, expanding our research and training capacity. Some of the institutions TUK is collaborating with include the following international universities. Augsburg University in Germany, Polytechnical di Milano in Italy, Technical University of Munich, Swane University of Technology in South Africa, Southern Utah University in the US, and Leeds University in Great Britain. At TUK, we believe in corporate social responsibility and impacting communities around us positively. Our motto is education and training for the real world. The Technical University of Kenya is giving the next generation of scientists, technicians, innovators and leaders the skills they will need to leave a lasting legacy in the world.